Yo, we back again with another installment of MGK in quarantine. These shits are fire. Roll it. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Channel's name is The Third Ernest. I'm Ernest Adiano The Third. Y'all guys are the third family. If you're new here and you're not subscribed, consider becoming part of the family, clicking the subscribe button bottom right hand corner. Now I'm probably gonna end up just doing all of these, but this one right here was one of the most requested ones after, like in all of the MGK videos. Like, yo, you need to do the smoke and drive. You need to do what's poppin' freestyle. Now the video is less than two minutes long. And because it says freestyle, I'm expecting some bars. Cause the other videos that weren't freestyles, they seem more just like conceptually driven like actual songs. This right here just says freestyle, so it's actually just gonna be whatever, whatever the fuck sounds dope. But that's all that I got to say. Follow your boy on Instagram and on Twitter at Third Ernest, just like the channel, links in the description below. Throw these bad boys on, the MDR 7506 professionals, and let's fucking get it. Yo, I've never even listened to Jack Harlow's music, ever. I actually didn't know who he was until like maybe like a week and a half ago. Yo, what up, man? Send me that Which instrumental one? real quick. Which one? What's popping? Oh, I got you right now. Yes, sir. Let's go. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's how me and my me and my brother say it. What's popping? Oh, I got you right now. Yes, sir. Let's go. What's popping? Just fuck my ex. I wrote it. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I didn't really, I didn't know he was just gonna not let the beat breathe for a second. He's just going right into the shits. What's poppin'? Just fuck my ex, I rot it. Two X in a mushroom chocolate. Two X on neck, I'm frosty. Mm. Stay dressing, no balsamic. Got commas, mm. Conde Garcondi. Cup guys, <laughs> cues like Conte. Chef Noble, cook me raw fish. <laughs> he said, I got dressing, no balsamic. <laughs> like balsamic vinegar dressing, but he's dressing. And then he said, I got commas, de Sargondi. Like commas, like he's got commas in his bank account, like millions of dollars. But also the the designer, the one that has the heart with the eyes. I forgot his, I don't know how to say his name. Then he said Cup's got ice cubes like Compton. Like the rapper Ice Cube is from Compton, but Cup, Ice Cubes. Just these little bars here and there. Not even here and there, like every single line. Chef Noble, cook me raw fish. Long beers, but the squad's not Amish. Just bosses, dropouts, and convicts. Why hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. The beat is fire. Gotta go back and listen to the words now. Chef Noble, cook me raw fish. Long beers, but the squad's not Amish. Just bosses, dropouts, and convicts. Wallace mm. bigger than Chris Wallace, dead presidents mm. inside is haunted. Yellow tape one. Wallet's so big like Christopher Wallace. Christopher Wallace, Notorious B.I.G. And then filled with dead presidents, it's haunted. Like haunted with dead presidents, the souls, but cash. Just fucking this guy. Then he said long beards, but the squad's not Amish. Like the Amish are known for having like that long beard like down to here. And then the squad is just a gang of a bunch of misfits, fucking dropouts, fucking convicts. It's gonna be a long ass video for a two minutes freestyle. <laughs> Wallace bigger than Chris Wallace, dead presidents inside is haunted. Yellow tape where I'm from, stay cautious. Made big snakes mm. wearing shirts with the horses. Spend a minute since I give a fuck about a critic's opinion, but they keep on forgetting where the bars went. Old timers, damn, y'all got all. It's been a minute since I've been digging or even thinking about what the critics say, but those same critics keep on forgetting where those bars went. You know where they go? Like this for most people. He said yellow tape where I'm from, stay cautious. Like yellow tape, like the caution tape, but also you gotta be cautious because he's not exactly from the nicest neighborhood in Cleveland. And I never listened to any of his mixtapes, so I don't even know what the covers of his mixtapes look like or what he was doing back then, but I'm assuming he's talking about a polo shirt, like the polo, like the shirt with the horses. I don't know, I don't know about that one. That's what I would assume though, because he's kind of like a fly motherfucker, you know? Give a fuck about a critic's opinion, but they keep on forgetting where the bars went, old timers. Damn, y'all got Alzheimer's, can't say what your subconscious think, be honest. Y'all hate that I switch genres, fuck models, switch condoms, eat beef like McDonald's, eat rappers, Jeff Dahmer, top five of the young rhymers. Why did y'all not tell me that he's fucking going off like this with bars? I was expecting this video right here that I'm making, like break down a bar here and there. Video's gonna be like nine minutes because it's a two minute video. Nah, this hell about to be 15, just like all my other videos. Fuck. All right, we gotta rewind because I gotta like pay attention. Opinion, but they keep on forgetting where the bars went. Old timers, damn, y'all got Alzheimer's. Can't say what your subconscious think, be honest. Y'all hate that I switch genres. Fuck models, switch condoms, eat beef like McDonald's, eat rap. He said eat beef like McDonald's, like eat beef like, like McDonald's hamburgers, but also eating beef like rap beef. And he said fuck models, switch condoms. Bro, like, we're just fucking nonstop over here. He said old timers, what y'all got Alzheimer's. <laughs> like old people do get Alzheimer's, but also calling us old, old timers like old heads, like people that didn't really like them. I guess I'm an old hip hop head. I'm like in the same, I'm in that same like range as J. Cole. Like I'm right in the middle between the new generation and the old generation of hip hop. But that line just plays onto the last bar where he said, y'all forgetting where the bars went. Like Alzheimer's forgetting where the bars went. Shh. 
And he said, be honest, y'all hated that I switched genres. Nah, boy, we all about that shit over here. If you can make some shit rock and you can make some shit rap, but they're both not, they're not like diluted versions. They're both quality. I don't give a fuck what genre you fit in, son. I hate that I switch genres. Fuck models, switch condoms, eat beef like McDonald's, eat rappers, Jeff Dahmer, tough. But oh, <laughs> eat rappers, Jeff Dahmer. Bro, eat rappers, Jeff Dahmer, like the serial killer. And then not only just the serial killer, like eat rappers, like the like what you put a McDonald's hamburger in. God damn it, MGK, motherfucker. But just listen to the scheme right here and like the rhythm of the pattern. That 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 shit's fire. Be honest, y'all hate that I switch genres. Fuck models, switch condoms, eat beef like McDonald's, eat rappers, Jeff Dahmer, top five of the young rhymers. Been sick, no virus. I'm an OG now. I do not pay homage. Look, I'm a Cleveland Cavalier. He said, I'm a OG now. I don't pay homage to OGs because your boy's been in the game for a minute. Y'all motherfuckers paying fucking homage to me now. That's a bar. If I said that's a bar for every bar, I'd be saying it like every bar, literally. And he said top five of the young rhymers. And to be honest, I, now I kind of think, now I kind of get it. He might be, he might be top five of this like generation. And then he said, I've been sick, no virus, because he's releasing the quarantine videos with the virus spreading, but he's been sick. He's His rhymes have been sick. I'm an OG now, I do not pay homage, look. I'm a Cleveland Cavalier, driving for an engineer. Ah. At the fashion week of Paris, Cinderella on my terrace. <laughs> Glass slipper on the stairs, ass fatter than she cares. Ah. I saw a live at the Super Bowl. I was in town for a movie role, Tussie slide in the boot. He said, I saw her live at the Super Bowl, just flexing the fact that he was there and that his bitch, whoever he's got on the terrace, that she's perfect like Cinderella. He's basically saying my life is fire and my bitch bad. This is what I mean by when I say good rappers can take like a certain subject and they can extend it and make it sound like in a way that no one's ever thought of before. He could have said I had a bad bitch on my terrace, but nah, he said, I got Cinderella out there on my terrace. Just so that way he could do the whole wordplay all the way down to the Super Bowl. Cause anyone could be literal, but can you be creative with your lines, you know? And a perfect example is when he said, I'm driving for an engineer. Like instead of saying I'm driving a foreign whip, instead of saying I'm in the bins or the Maybach or the Rolls or the Wraith or whatever, calls it foreign engineered. And from what I know, just thinking back in my lyrical catalog in my brain, I don't think I've ever heard anyone say it like that before. And that's what I mean by being creative with the bars, you know? I was in town for a movie roll, Tussie slide in a booty hole, smoking wood, <laughs> seeing tuna roll, playing cards like it's Yu-Gi-Oh! And I was only in the studio. I wake up, I'm moody, I roll up some fruity that have more colors than a Coogee coat. I'm not a rapper that talk about designer, but this is from Virgil and Louis Do. And he said, I roll up some fucking weed that got more colors, collars, more colors than a Kooji coat. Royce the 5'9 was just talking about Kooji sweaters in like his last Thou Shall like freestyle that he did on LA Leakers. <laughs> he said, Tootsie slide in the booty hole. Like, it's funny because I thought it was Tootsie slide for the longest, which would have made sense. Like, like shit, like Tootsie rolls kind of look like shit, but Tootsie slide in the booty hole. <laughs> Then he say playing cars like it's Yu-Gi-Oh, like Yu-Gi-Oh, the card game. Yo, that Tuesday slide in the booty hole, though, that shit caught me off guard. And he said, I'm not the type of rapper that talks about designer. Like, even though I'm wearing that shit, I don't be talking about it on my raps. But this right here that I'm wearing is from Virgil, Virgil Abloh, the creator of Off-White, and Louis, Louis Vuitton. The scheme is sick right there. I wake up, I'm moody, I roll up some fruity that have more colors than a Coogee coat. I'm not a rapper that talk about designer, but this is from Virgil and Louis, though. Ah. Inside my closet, it's a million options. I put on all black like a funeral. Ah. I'm about to play in the pajamas. I do this shit daily. I don't even plan it. Whoa, what's poppin'? I do this shit daily. I don't even plan it. I just be fly. I just be hopping in the G7 or whatever the fuck level they're at now. It was G5, then G. I'm assuming we're at like G7 now. But he said millions of options in my closet. I just throw on all black like I'm going to a funeral, like Johnny Cash. Why are you wearing all black? It looks like you're going to a funeral. Maybe I am. Psh. And you know one of this boy's musical inspirations is probably Johnny Cash, just because he had Johnny Cash had like that edge, just like MGK has that edge in his genre of music that he falls in. This shit is live as fuck. I hop up the plane in pajamas. I do this shit daily. I don't even plan it. Whoa, what's poppin'? Just fuck my ex. I rot it. Two X and a mushroom chocolate. Two X on neck. I frostbite. Two mm -hmm. eggs with cheese and sausage. I'm a dead. She fed me toppings. Three X's ah. next to the names of the last three hoes. All my miss call us. Yeah, yeah. Just the swagger in the flow is like fucking next level. He said three X's next to the names, next to three hoes that are on my miss call list. Like he's just fucking not even answering these hoes where other dudes would be all about trying to get at him. And the three X's to let him know that they're that, that he only has them to fuck. Like porn, like three X's. And then the stunt, she fed me two eggs and cheese and sausage and she fed me topless. 
Oh, what a life. Yeah, she fed me topics. Three X's next to the names of the last three hoes on my Miss Carlis. Yeah. Yeah. Red eyes, I can't see clear. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Red eyes, I can't see clear. Like clear eyes that like gets the redness out and the red because he's high. Yo. Yeah. Yeah. Red eyes, I can't see clear. Whoa. Whoa. My brick so white it glow. Damn. Mm. Damn. She made it only fans. Ugh. <laughs> Can't write my life in books. I'm back to my old ways of it. All right, fucking, I'm good. I thought he was gonna go the fuck off again, but he could have. But he said she got an OnlyFans. Ugh, <laughs> these hoes with the OnlyFans, bro. Like that's how you know that dudes are idiots. Only dudes would pay thirty dollars a month to see some bitches' titties. Ain't no chick gonna pay no thirty dollars a month to see some fucking dick hanging out. You know? It's the same reason why female strip clubs are in abundance and male strip clubs are not. Yeah. Now I know why y'all wanted me to do that track. Well, she was fucking fire. The, the swagger, the flow, the rhyme schemes, the similes and metaphors, the creative wordplay of like saying, saying something, but saying it in a different way that's unusual, that's unique. Yeah, and the mood and just the vibe of this video. Like, like I'm just stupid impressed about everything so far of these videos. Like they're just, they're just so good. MGK is out here winning the celebrity quarantine battle and it ain't even fucking close. But yo, that's it for today's video, ladies and gentlemen. If you like it, leave a like and thumbs up and leave a comment, all that shit that helps the algorithm catch the activity and send it out there to other people to view. It helps the channel, helps me, and helps you. I don't know how it helps you, so scratch that, but it definitely helps me. If you like what you see enough, please consider subscribing because that does help you to get these notifications because this is how we do it every video. We break down the bars. Follow your boy on Instagram and on Twitter at the third earnest just like the channel links are down in the description below hit up the discord discord also linked down in the description below if you want to chat it up with me that's definitely the place to do it because that's where you're going to find me the most but that's it for today ladies and gentlemen i appreciate your time i appreciate you watching this video it's definitely going to be longer people are going to be in the comments bro really a 12 minute video for fucking a two minute song yes bro really don't blame me blame ngk no one told him to put that kind of wordplay in those type of bars you know? But that's it, fam. Like I always say at the end, go out there in the world, love and care for one another, love and care for each other. And I'll catch everybody on the next video. Peace.